peace, happy now, now's the vibrate, <laughs> remember, not too far in the future, not too far in the past, right now, right now, you know, other than Mercury retrograde, which is really coming to an end right now, and different energies upon my my own self that I'm dealing with, you know what I'm saying? Brought me to this this subject right now. Matter of fact, I'm actually, uh, I know if you haven't heard my other video, I'm actually moving out of Louisiana. I know moving to Moreno Valley, California, you know. And it, it had me, you know, just thinking about it and also as I'm in the process of this, there's certain omens and things that's just been coming to me, you know, and matter of fact, being that Mercury retrograde has been passing while making this decision, I've just been kind of staying in the moment, not trying to overthink, not trying to overdo, but just kind of, you know, stay in the moment. But I thought about, too, about uh, how, because uh, I, I, I saw a video on this about, like, how some of the elders... Like say, for instance, some of the elders who meant to be here for a certain amount of time and then go, you know what I'm saying? Like they're not, you know, meant to be on this physical plane for so long, you know, or they only meant to be here for so long and then go. But by how much, how could I say, how much love they generated, like say, for instance, somebody like a figure like Michael Jackson, where say, for instance, if it was time for him to go at the age of 40 and he was on a deathbed, say, for instance, if he was on that deathbed at the age of 40, you know what I'm saying, ready to go, that that love and that vibrational love from everybody, from all the fans who really love him, you know, as co-creators in this universe, you know what I'm saying, you know, that goes into play too. But that vibration of love will actually keep, you know, keep Mike, and it's hypothetically speaking, but keep him, you know, in this realm, you know, and stop him from transitioning, you know what I'm saying? In which, you know, it'd be his time to transition, but because of that love and the vibration and that connection, you know what I'm saying, of the people and the fans and family members and everybody, you know what I'm saying, that that vibration and that connection is what would, you know, and just in general, getting away from Michael Jackson, just anybody in general, that's what would keep them on this plane, you know what I'm saying? Even though it would be time for them to, you know, quote unquote time for them to, you know, to transition. But reason why I thought about this, because, uh, you know, my transition with, with my physical transition, but not away from this, uh, <laughs> this plane of existence, but my physical transition on Earth while moving to Cali, you know, and thinking about how, like, you know, I've been careful about who I tell them and, and when, I'm, when I'm telling them because I know that, you know, I, I generate, you know, by doing what I do, doing, just being, you know, I am what I am, the unconditional love that I am. I know I create certain type of bonds and friendships and certain type of love that will be missed, you know what I'm saying? And I kind of watch and been watching who I tell because, you know, of course, with all good intentions, everybody, I, for the most part, you know, want to see me, you know, be happy and, and go off and, you know, and and enjoy, you know, California and do the things that I want. But at the same time, you know what I'm saying, just because cause everybody haven't learned to, you know, get away from ego completely like that, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's a little bit of that that feeling where some people are going to feel like, man, but, you know, I kind of don't want Car to leave, you know? Like, I... You know, I kind of want them to stay, you know, and even though, you know, and, that, and that's what it is, what it is, too, in that essence, well, you know, in, in the heart, like, where you truly want me to be happy, but also you kind of like, you know, man, I wish I could. Because, too, you're not having that understanding of, well, you know, even though he's moving, I could manifest, you know, and get what I want and go visit instead of trying to retract and bring down, because a lot of people don't understand that, too. You don't want to retract somebody's growth and bring down if somebody's growing then you need to say well shit i'm gonna grow and get on that level so i so so we can stay connected you know what i'm saying that mean i'm gonna just have to you know get on that on, on, on a certain type of level raise my vibration do whatever it is you know what i'm saying and and reach that status instead of saying oh man well i hope i hope that person fall back to this status you know what i'm saying nah it don't work like that you know 
but I thought about that, you know, in, in my approach of, you know, who I'm telling, you know, and when I'm telling, you know, people about my move, you know, because of that vibration that, you know, automatically comes, like I tell some people too, is that emotional vibration is energy and motion, you know what I'm saying? If somebody hear, like, certain news that you hear, like, if somebody, like, oh, Kari about to move, and it's like, oh, like, man, like, man, he about to move. Like, you know, you ain't even have to think that thought, you know what I'm saying? Because that energy, that emotional energy moves faster than thought, you know what I'm saying? So it hit, like, boom, like, man, man, why the brethren gotta go? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so many lessons I, you know, I want to you know, attain from the bridge and all this and that. That's another thing, you know what I'm saying? This is just physical. Uh, they got social media, all these things, you know, and all this for us to connect. And yes, this is a message to everybody, you know, also, you know, like I'm still, I'm still here, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm just physically moving, but I'm still, as a matter of fact, and I'm here in vibration, you know what I'm saying? As far as like telepathy, you know what I'm saying? But just back on subject though, you know, other people's, you know, love for you, you know, that vibrational love, or a matter of fact, and in some essence, you know what I'm saying, hate, you know what I'm saying, because you may tell some people who, you know what I'm saying, of things you're doing, because matter of fact, that, that's where the idea of, like, as a business person and things of this nature, like, one of the ideas is that you don't really tell too many people you know, what you got in store, what you got planned, because that gives, matter of fact, like I thought to myself, that gives haters a canvas to paint that, that picture on, you know, to paint that messed up picture they want to paint of you, you know what I'm saying? By by giving them that, I, you know, your ideas, you know, or, you know, the ideas of what you're doing, you know, or, or, or the things of how you're progressing yourself, you know, that also put out that gives haters a chance to latch on to something and say, man, I, I hope he never make it. I hope they tie, go flat. I hope, you know what I'm saying? I hope bad, I hope bad, I hope bad, you know what I'm saying? So, two, that's another reason why, you know, being watchful of sharing certain information, that's kind of where that come from because all that too, like in a business model too, where you see the people who like quiet about their certain things, you know what I'm saying, that they do, they just kind of rise up quick because they don't create that, they don't give haters that canvas to, you know, create and paint that messed up picture, you know what I'm saying, they just quiet. Well, next thing you know, they up to a certain level where person they ain't even got the power to they hate can't even affect that you know it's so low and that person done rolled so quick where they ain't even had time to for they hate which hate is a lower vibration anyway so you know as long as you stay stay focused you know and stay meditating and stay away from the negative energy anyway it wouldn't even get to you but like I say back to the process of people knowing you know uh, your business or the things that you have, you know, the actions that you take and uh, different moves you're about to make, you know, that that all, every we all are co-creators, you know what I'm saying, co-creating our universe, you know what I'm saying, so at, at the same time, even though my vibration is strong and my heart is strong for where I want to go and what I want to do, you know what I'm saying, there's also people, you know what I'm saying, which we all are one, is all one connection, but there's also people who feel strong, you know, about me and kind of, you know, want my presence to be around, you know. So, and, and thank you, and applying this to your life, you know what I'm saying, where if you're trying to make a move do or do certain things, you know what I'm saying, it, you're not just creating by yourself, you know, you are a co-creator. So, things may, you know, possibly, and that's where the psychic protection dealing with the stones come in, where, uh, you know what I'm saying, matter of fact, where, uh, was that a uh, fire agate or fire gate would come in handy because fire agate, you know, when people throw them psychic attacks at you, you know what I'm saying, it throws it, you know, it bounces right back and teaches them a lesson with it, you know, to not, hey, like, don't be trying to pull people down too with you, you know, you just gotta learn how to, you know. And when I say that, it's not like no, because another pe other some people get caught up in that where it's not no levels like, oh, just because somebody's at a certain conscious level, somebody's doing a certain thing in their life, like, no, it's just we're at different stages of our life, and sometimes, you know, matter of fact, my hand motions or movements, I may do that, but that don't, it's not to imply that we're on different levels or we're not the same or anything of that nature, you know what I'm saying? But, 
that's just the you know the basis is that we're co-creators and all our vibrations go to go together and creating you know what i'm saying our universe or our existence you know but let's see and matter of fact yeah, we are co-creators and matter of fact and that's why certain people that's hungry for power and control you know, basically, they manipulated the, or they manipulated the conscious perception of "quote unquote" reality in this "quote unquote" timeline. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, some people got you thinking. You know, they know if they get everybody kind of consciously thinking on a certain level, then now these 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 diseases and all like AIDS and all these things now they become real because we got the collective consciousness of everybody believing it's real so now it becomes reality you know what I'm saying because once we start conscious shifting higher than the reality that are, are, are safe as the reality that we once were in where we knew that we are beings of light and that crystal energy and and things naturally coming from God was better than you know all these fake things when we get back to that you know what I'm saying that'll become the reality you know what I'm saying well matter of fact like right now as the vibration is raising that old thought form and them old that old reality is dying off you know what I'm saying as above so below so as the thought form dying off the people are dying off along with it you know what I'm saying but that's that's the same thing like like as far as like with the co-creating you know we we basically create our own universe you know what i'm saying like the the biggest thing the biggest secret you know which i know a lot of people like you know like yeah that, i mean at this point man it's understood it's profound knowledge but yes i mean it's a it's a free will universe you know what i'm saying you create but at the same time it's about unconditional love and knowing that you know what i'm saying matter of fact that's why you see like uh, in the future with, with uh, I mean, and I say see in the future, but like with the Star Wars, where you see like how they got it built, where as a council of good and evil, where they come together and they understand the universe, even though they may be on the opposite sides, you know what I'm saying? Because they know how the universe work, you know? But, and that's the thing, because it's all about the perceptions, you know what I'm saying? Like whoever, you know, has, how could I say, whichever powerful vibration is out there, a thought form is out there, that's kind of what controls the reality. So if the thought form of that is some only certain people can have money and certain people can't, if you create that thought form, then that's going to create the reality because once it gets in people's brains as above, so below, it starts creating that reality physically. You know what I'm saying? So matter of fact, and, and matter of fact, and, and it was funny, like, too, how spiritual knowledge, like, and, and how... how uh, you know, uh, pimping, you know what I'm saying, so to speak, and the action of pimping where they say get a female, and I'm not, you know, indulging and in, in promoting this, but I'm just speaking, you know, how they tie together, how they say, because this is what the government and the, and the people have been doing to us, pimping our spirits, but, you know what I'm saying, once you get the female mind, then, you know, you have the rest, you know what I'm saying, and the physical is yours, once you have the female's brain, once you have the chick brain, or, or vice versa, if you're a female pimp, you know, once you have the, once you have the man's brain, then, you know what I'm saying, the rest is, is history, <laughs> you know, <laughs> literally and figuratively speaking, you know what I'm saying, the rest is history, what somebody been trying to do, control reality through, Thought forms and make their own history. You know what I'm saying? Creating their own messiahs. You know, creating their own religions. Trying to create uh, their own certain type of reality. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, but it's a certain is a certain order that wasn't you know what well, that's not that wasn't supposed to happen and, not, and it's not being allowed to happen. You know what I'm saying? But it, it all goes from you know from our collective consciousness and our own perception, you know what I'm saying? So I, I, it all adds up to, you know, our thoughts, our word vibrations, you know, it manifests, you know what I'm saying? And it comes from that that electro, that electromagnetic energy of the heart, you know, them, them high vibrations, them electrical solar vibrations of the heart, you know what I'm saying? Reaching out, connecting and manifesting. That's why we manifest most of the things that come easy or manifest easy in our, in our lives are things that are truly heartfelt, you know what I'm saying? And not necessarily thought forms, which for the most case though too, thought forms manifest because that, it, it, it does, it, how could I say, 
it starts with the heart, you know, and then it goes to the mind. So when the heart's voice is very low, then yeah, you're creating off of what you've been taught and, and things of this nature too. It goes back to what I say, like when somebody done pimp your mind frame and got you thinking a certain way, then your actions and, you know, you create a certain type of physical universe that falls in line with that, with that, 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 that bad information you've been given, you know. But just remember that, you know what I'm saying, our, our words, our thoughts, everything we focus on, you know, it actually creates, you know what I'm saying. So, you know, when, when so-and-so moving here or this and that, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Be you know you wanna be you wanna be happy and, and, and to have that empathy to realize hey if I was moving and you know and I was spreading my wings and going out and and doing what I love you know I want people to be happy for me so in that moment I'm, I'm gonna be happy for this person because I I would want them same positive vibrations you know coming my way you know. And that's where the world start becoming a better place is when the, the empathy and the unconditional love is realized, you know what I'm saying? Basically. But that's all I have to that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> you know, my, my far as gump imitation, which I ain't try hard. I could do better, but <laughs> anyway. But you know, yes, we are co creators and you know, I, even though, you know, your own thoughts and your own words are very strong, even though you may be meditating, even though you are on your ascension, you know, you know, lower vibrations are just any outside vibrations, because which is all a part of you, you know what I'm saying? They, those vibrations, if, if they exist in the universe, even at a smallest bit, that mean it exists in this mental universe, you know, at a small little bit, you know what I'm saying? As above, so below, you know what I'm saying? What's on the inside gets projected outside, you know. But peace. Happy now. Now's the vibrate. Not too far in the future. Not too far in the past. Right now, peace.